hey guys hope you're all having a good day um i've come on holiday well i've come home to my hometown aradia and hoping to see a few species of birds while i'm here just as i'm walking along um the river bank this river that crosses uh, the city i've seen a turn uh, some sort of turn species flying by so it's a good start the problem is it's really hot as it's summer here in continental europe it's about 36 40 degrees as a proper summer it's a big change from the british summer so we'll see how it goes like a blackbird's paradise the spot I found the blackbirds all over the place huh? youngsters adults there's one right there exactly it is doing at the moment I believe this bridge has been restored since last time I've been home and they also created this underpass which we didn't have for years and years slowly slowly we are making improvements to the city trying to attract tourists we we'll got there much to my surprise, this part of the river is called Krishul Repede in Romanian, Shabash Kurdish in Hungarian. It's pretty crystal clear. Mallets. Ducklings following mom. Now I've identified one crucial obstacle to photography in this hot weather. As I'm carrying the camera like that on this trap thing from Think Tank by the way. The display and the EVF gets so hot that when I pull them up to my face 
and it touches my skin and it literally burns it's not particularly a pleasant experience to be honest it's definitely not something you would like to have when you're trying to photograph anything but hey this is one of the things you have to put up with if you go to a country with a hot climate well hot climate in the summer at least the strange thing is that since I moved to the UK about nine years ago I kind of got disused to this kind of hot weather even though I was born and raised here so I should say that I'm used to it but no not anymore this is one of the leftover parks one of the few we have left in the city um, I believe its name is Park Ulicha Britiano I'm not 100% sure what it's called now um, I don't know if it's got still the same name Not too many birds hanging around I've seen two blackbirds and a grated I also can't hear any much more Maybe they are having a siesta It's siesta time for the birds Who knows There's a baby blackbird here most likely waiting for the friends to come back with some food it's looking quite thin hello oh, baby bird down the river bank and we'll see what I can catch I'm pretty happy with the turn I think one of the best improvements in town is um, these river bank cafes especially in this hot weather it's quite nice to just sit there and chill Have a cold drink something oh here we go down to the riverbank another blackbird now I don't know if it's because of the heat that blackbirds are so tame or they're just so tame by their nature here on the continent because the ones we have in the UK another one is trying to cool itself down because the ones we have in the UK they are not tame at all well I think the weather is cooling a little bit down I can feel that it's probably not 40 anymore, maybe 35 degrees. That comes handy. So let's focus on the birds. Another interesting thing I've noticed we have loads of dragonflies or damselflies, whichever is difficult to say, unless you see them from up close. But as I walk along the river, I've seen loads of them. I just didn't manage to get a shot, annoyingly. Anyway, I haven't seen much so far in this part of the river. So I'll just continue the journey. Not many birds so far, but there's uh, some sort of terrapin.
Boss can cap it in the sun. No fucks given. That's a life, eh? I'm slowly progressing down by the river. Oh, there's a buddy. That's one of our latest bridges. It's been built a few years ago. And this is the second part of the river. Wow. This is the part of the river in the um, Dechabal area, I believe. This side is Yoshia, and this side is Dechabal, and leading towards Rogerius. Enjoying a little lukewarm water in the river. It's obviously because of the high temperatures the water gets pretty warm. So you'll see all these families enjoying the little bit of splash. It's pretty nice. I used to do that as well when I was a child. Or should I say as long as I lived in Radia. I can tell it's been quite a while since I've been here because I forgot the areas of the city. This section of the river is actually still part of the central section up to that bridge over there which is the Dechabal bridge. So that's where actually Dechabal and Rogerius area start. Oh well, I start remembering slowly, slowly. Or maybe I'm just too excited to see what kind of birds I can find, or any kind of wildlife for that matter. Because I'm also happy to photograph these dens of flies and dragonflies. And the terrapin I saw. Still good, but can always be better. My nephew told me that these east quarters are booming here as well, so you can find these green scooters all over the place, left over. Well, just like in London, no difference. I mean, it's pretty cool. So I've made progress um, to the Rogeria section of the river. Some pigeons by the dozen. And you can find these swan looking water bicycles that you can use for your leisure. And this one is another sort of a recently built bridge well, it's only a few years old and there you go the prices opening hours One thing I've not seen so far is a bird of prey. Would be nice to see some sort of falcons. But 
I've got a location that I have to check so I'll be heading there probably tomorrow well definitely one of these days that I'm staying so keep tuned in let's see what we can find <laughs> 